going on guys? My name is Shane and very good morning. It might not be morning for you guys, but for me, I literally just woke up a couple minutes ago and I'm still trying to wake up. I have some, uh, honestly, it's not, it's not coffee. <laughs> it's some hot chocolate. And I put some fluff in it. Mm. Anyways, I needed to film this video in the morning because today we have a subscription box. I'm always honest with you guys whenever I'm sent product or if I buy product on with my own money. This was sent to me for review, but like with any collaboration that I do on my channel, I always make sure that 100% of opinions are my own. I don't want to be paid to say something if I truly don't believe in it. I don't believe in trying to sell you guys something, but I do believe in trying beauty products and if you like them or if I like them, I'm gonna talk about them. There will be a link in the description throughout the video if you wanna check it out for yourself. You're free to use my code as well. Obviously, you don't have to. It's just there to save you guys some money. But today, we are trying the No Make, No Life Korean and Japanese beauty box. I'm super excited. I've always loved watching like Japanese beauty unboxing or like when people are trying them on their face I think one their packaging is probably gonna be so cool and two they just have like unique products that you can't just go into like your local drugstore and find here in the States so I'm really really excited to try and I'm sure it's gonna be full of some awesome skincare so I wanted to make sure that my face was fresh in the morning all I did was take a little bit of makeup wipes to remove any excess makeup I might have had on my face but I haven't washed it or anything so we're gonna see what's in this and I also have just a bowl of water um, just in case I really hope that there is a face wash or some sort in here because I am on the market for a new one but I came prepared just in case so I didn't have to get up a thousand times so let's just go ahead and open up the box hello so as soon as you open up the box it says hey beautiful love your box tag and share and you can use the hashtag no make no life Ooh, already what okay let me before I even take anything out of the box let me show you guys what's in here there are a couple things that are immediately grabbing my interest let's just take a quick look at everything the first thing that is catching my interest is this whipped cream face wash I hope there's English instructions somewhere because <laughs> it doesn't look like it. I mean, it seems like it might be pretty self-explanatory, at least for this one, but this is interesting. I'm wondering. I'm wondering because it only looks like you get like two packets in there. Um, so I'm wondering if you only get to use this twice, but you can see that this is entirely in either Japanese or Korean. It has a little diagram here showing you actually how to make the face wash. So this one definitely caught my interest right away, <laughs> but I'll be a little disappointed if it's only like a two time face wash kind of thing, but we'll, we'll have to see. I might have to look up um, English instructions online for some of these products. The next thing that I'm seeing is, oh yay, okay, so we have a honey skincare face wash with natural fragrance, enriched with natural honey, gently cleanses while hydrating skin, keeps the skin's natural oil balance, and leaves the skin naturally soft and smooth. This seems like quite a large packaging, um, so I'm pretty excited that these aren't like just sample sizes. Of course, the back again is not in English. This one says it's made in Japan. Um, but yeah, really excited because again, a lot of subscriptions box I tend to get, um, it just kind of has sample sizes. So I'm excited to get like full size products in, in this blind bag, blind bag, <laughs> this mystery box. Um, the next thing I'm seeing, oh, this might actually be like our instruction manual. Okay. Cool. So this actually does tell me about each of the products that um, are in here. So this will come in handy. So I'm going to leave that aside. Oh, we have a lot of products in here. Okay. I recognize this little um, mascot, this little bunny here. I've seen it a bunch of times at Ulta. This is the Petite. Oh, the sticker is covering it. Hold on. Petite Bunny Gloss Bar. All right, we'll play with everything. Um, then we have a skin essential, snail essential cream. Um, okay, that's what, <laughs> that, that one's a little terrifying to me. I know that like snail is like really, really good for your skin. I'm just 
I've always wondered how I would feel about putting it on my own face. <laughs> Then we have what looks like a little compact. It says Lovely Cookie Blusher. Oh, so this might actually be a makeup product instead of just skincare, which would be super cute. The packaging alone is super cute. Then we have a Mint Chocolate Moist Lip Pack. Um, it looks like just like a lip mask. I've used these in the past. One of my subscribers sent me some as well. Um, and I really did like them and my lips could definitely use some moisture. So very cool. And then we have a couple more. I think these are the last two products it seems. It looks like we might have gotten another makeup sort of product. This is from Daydream Unicorn. It's a two-way eye and a lip gloss. Very cool. No, I've been trying to get into lip glosses again recently, um, but I'm more interested in, in using it as an eye gloss. It seems super metallic and it might look really, really pretty. So um, we'll have to try that as well. And then we have a Choco Mint face mask. Ooh, very cool. So I definitely want to use some of these products today. I have two different face washes, so I'm going to have to use one today, one tomorrow. So I've kind of gone through this little booklet and figure out sort of what order I want to use stuff. So what should I use today? I mean, both of these are going to be used um, in in the video anyways, but I almost feel like because I'm using a lot of products in this one sit down that I want to save this one for tomorrow. As much as this one interests me, definitely, I want to I want to save it, I think. So we're going to try that one tomorrow. So I think the first thing that we're going to do is wash my face using the Honey Skincare Face Wash. This says, to achieve the natural glow you need to take good care of your skin, in August box come one of the four variations. Deeply moisturizing, honey, rose or charcoal. Honestly, I'm glad that we got the honey one and it says the tip is to use this face wash in the morning and in the evening. Oh, <laughs> and it's a face wash with all natural ingredients. So I have my little bowl of water here and I'm going to place it on the turntable I've been using in this video and we are going to see, does it have a little safety seal first of all? Nope, no safety seal. I'm gonna go ahead and wet my face real quick. So I'm just gonna take a little bit of water. Yeah, the face, the face moisture, um, the face wash I'm using right now is from, I think, Clean and Clear, and it's burning my face. <laughs> so I need to stop using it. So I'm glad that we have a new alternative, and I'm really hoping that I'll like it. So it just kind of feels like a moisturizer coming out. First of all, ooh. Hi. <laughs> it does smell really, really nice. It doesn't feel like it's super chemically or anything like that. It does feel a little thick and I feel like maybe I just didn't add enough water. So I'm adding a little bit more just using my fingertips. Oh, it is really nice though. I think I added too much. <laughs> I think I used too much product so I feel like you could use a lot less than I did and get away with it. <laughs> oh my goodness. Well, it's, it's it's covering. Holy smoke. I didn't even feel like I used that much. Oh, you know what's funny? I can see through this and I can see that it's only filled up to here. So that's a little deceiving. Maybe even less. Cause like it's coming up the sides a little here, but it kind of stops right here, like halfway. I see you. Okay, let me wash this off <laughs> real quick. Okay, I th should have thought about grabbing a towel. I wasn't prepared for that, but I do have some makeup wipes here, so I'm just gonna help uh, remove some of this excess water and product using these wipes. And I can still see some foundation coming off. Granted, I didn't wash like my neck or anything, and that's where a lot of this product is coming from, but it does feel really, really nice. Um, I do usually go in, when I'm washing my face, I'll usually go in with a makeup wipe first and remove any like excess makeup, and then I'll go in after with a cleanser. So, you know, obviously I can still see some makeup uh, eye makeup being removed, but that's normal. Okay, so that was our first product. Let's move this bowl out of the way. It's definitely dirty now. Um, I really like it. So far, my face doesn't feel too tight. It feels a tiny bit of tightening, but that could have also been from the makeup wipes because I always get that effect after using the wipes. But the face wash itself was very soothing. It felt good. It didn't feel like I felt no stinging whatsoever. Um, I feel like it was very, very gentle and definitely 
something that I'm going to be using um, and keeping in my medicine cabinet. I, th I think I'm going to throw it either in my shower so I can wash my face in the shower or have it in my medicine cabinet um, and wash my face every morning. But I really, really like that product so far. So, so far, so good. The next thing that I'm going to do is do the face mask. So again, this is the Choco Mint face mask. Choco Mint is super trendy in Japan and not only when it comes to food, even sheet masks come in this trendy flavor. Okay, it just says a unique mask that uses mint to tighten the skin. I don't know how long I need to keep this on. I think it says, because mm, it says 10 to 15, like on this last little diagram. So that's what I'm gonna do it on. Because I'm kind of in a rush today, I'm gonna do it for 10 minutes. I think it's just one of those standard, like really, really wet face masks. Yeah, it is. <laughs> it's one of those little sheet masks. I'm kind of bummed though, like I wish, oh, I don't like using products just once because I, I, I ended up really, really liking them. <laughs> but I'll have to, you know, maybe on the website they have, oh wow, it's dripping. Um, maybe they have more that you can actually like order. Just because today in particular, I'm kind of on a time crunch. Um, I think we're gonna save the lip mask for tomorrow. So tomorrow, which will still be in this video, we're gonna try the whipped cream face mask and we're gonna try the uh, mint lip mask, but I'm not going to be able to wait for two masks to be done before I start getting ready. What on earth? I feel like I'm ripping it by accident. And, oh, I think I ripped it a little bit. <laughs> what? What's going on here? Oh, I don't, I'm not the biggest fan of these. I'm not gonna lie, but we're gonna do it for the sake of the video. Oh, it's just so wet and so cold. <laughs> I'm <laughs> such a child. <laughs> oh, I can call my lip. Okay, let's, um, has anyone ever seen that video that was floating online of this kid who, like, he applied a face mask, but he applied it so perfectly that it almost, like, you couldn't even see it <laughs> anymore. But he, like, pushed it so perfectly into his skin that it almost disappeared and looked like his actual skin. It was crazy. This little piece right here does not, like, begs to be eaten. The smell is really, really nice, I will admit. It's not, like, overpowering. But I'm gonna try to pull these edges a little bit. This is kind of hard, though, because I'm just working with the viewfinder on my camera, which isn't very big. <laughs> Once it's on, it doesn't feel as gross to me. It's just, like, that first initial apl application that I can't stand. <laughs> I breathed in my nostril and that went in. Here we go. Our timer is going. So, we can probably do another product while we're trying this because I am going to hydrate my face using the snail cream today. But the only other product that I was going to use today, um, I'm going to save the makeup products for tomorrow as well. So, I'm going to put them in a little pile so I don't forget. So, we have four products for tomorrow still. But I think the last product today besides this nail cream is going to be this little hydrating bunny. It sounded kind of like a... Uh, like a chapstick. So this is a to Tony Moly Petite Bunny Gloss Bar. It says you can use it on top of a matte lipstick to create a different effect, but it's a cute and moisturizing bunny bar, bunny gloss bar. So maybe it's more like a cosmetic than an actual chapstick, but let's go ahead, take it off the cover. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, because it's got some color to it. You see that? It's kind of like a pinky color, but use the bottom. Oh. Okay, so maybe I will have to wait until the end of this mask to try it. But I'm gonna stop talking and I'm gonna watch me some Wentworth on Netflix for 10 minutes, so I'll be right back. All right, here we go, guys. So it's been <clears throat> 10 minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and remove this. Then we're just gonna work the extra um, product that's on my face into my skin. And then we are gonna finish up this morning and using the Snail Essential Cream. I'm not gonna lie, this <laughs> kinda grosses me out. Um, but I feel like if I just don't think of what it is, then maybe we'll be okay. It says snail mucus is a popular ingredient for snail skin care nowadays. It effectively improves your skin's el elasticity. This cream comes in a convenient pouch, includes 10 different kinds of seeds to moisturize your skin. It moisturizes your skin and reduces fine lines. So 
we're gonna just you know what we have it we're gonna use it up i'm terrified i hope it's not i uh, please just be white oh god ew 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 <laughs> ew ew it's super clear it's translucent and it just looks like exactly what it is <laughs> i don't like it all right we're gonna suck it up just suck it up come on <laughs> just suck it up ew i'm pretty grossed out but i'm just trying to think that you know what it's just another it's just another beauty product on the market right that's all it is luckily it doesn't have like a gross smell to it, to it or anything but it does feel nice on the skin i'm not gonna lie it does feel moisturizing i was just um really hoping that it would just kind of look like a lotion <laughs> Um, anyways, guys, that is it for this morning. I'm going to go get ready. I will see you tomorrow morning, and we will use some more of these products. My daughter will probably be joining me tomorrow just because my husband happens to be home today, so she's downstairs with him. Anyways, I will see you guys in the part two of this video. Um, and yeah, I told you guys it might be impossible. <laughs> today to film <laughs> hi somebody just took a bubble bath um it's yes. actually a couple mornings later i haven't been feeling that well to be honest i got you know did a little bit of makeup this morning to go to work but like i just mm -hmm. kind of want to take a shower and go back to bed <laughs> i knew i needed to film the rest of the subscription box because we had some other products to show you guys so, um, obviously I have makeup on today, um, but on my lips, I only have chapstick, so we can still try the, hi honey, we can still try the Tony Moly, um, chapstick and see what that looks like. Oh, it's a clear. I don't know if it's a lipstick or like a, oh, it's do you pink. see color? Yeah. A lot of color or a little bit of color? I see a little bit of color. It might be, I think it's too light for me. <laughs> it's a little too light for me especially considering that i had been tanning um but it does feel very moisturizing though i will give it that <laughs> i feel like a you... dark pink one from my see like it looks pretty on someone that like she's so fair but like it looks really pretty on her so i think it's a little again a little too light for me um, and that's if I continue tanning. My natural skin color is closer to this. <laughs> um, but it is very moisturizing. Beautiful, honey. Very nice. It's so I won't necessarily like throw it away because like I said, during the winter, I might not be tanning Oh, it looks like a cute little bunny. Isn't that cute? Yeah, okay. See? Okay, right here. There you go. Cute. And then it's got to focus. Hold on. There we go. And then we have this little blusher, which yeah. is super cute. Maybe we can try this on you too. I just love the packaging and I knew that I would love the packaging. Let us come back a little bit more. Um, I, I knew right away that I would end up liking the packaging. On already. Yeah, you tried this one on already? What? You tried this one on already? No. Oh. So it has a little safety seal. But the compact is super adorable. It comes with a little powder puff and then there is the color. And I do believe um, they came with a variety of colors too. Girl, you have one though. <laughs> um, there is a little piece of plastic on top of the blush itself. Oh, it's very soft. Whoa, boy. That color might be a little too light for me as well. Yeah. I don't even know if you guys can kind of see that on my can hand. Blush them on a little bit. Oh, it doesn't have a finger blush, but let's, um, I never use powder puffs. Let me try it on my skin first. I don't know. Oh gosh, <laughs> it's on this one. Oh, it's pigmented. I, I'm, I'm working with the viewfinder again. <laughs> can I do that by myself? You want to try it too? Yeah, uh, okay. I, this time I'm going to do it. All right, on ready? Side. Here. I'll give you a little bit of blush. Here, you, you can do it. And then you can put it on. <laughs> it's a little bit light. Let me see. Yeah, it's super pigmented. A little goes a long way, but once again, for my complexion. It's a little bit light on my cheek. Because but like my again, skin. with the fair skin, it's super pretty. It's a super pretty blush. Um, very, very pigmented as well. And again, the packaging is 10 out of 10. Yeah, there's so like a bow eye on it. I think we'll definitely have to try some other colors, just a little bit darker for me. We also had this eye gloss, which 
baby i'm gonna i'm just gonna use this one because i want to try it on my eye and i don't want to share like eye stuff because it's not good but um just a little reminder this was like the eye gloss i was more interested in it as an eye gloss it can be used as a lip gloss but i don't feel like it would be a product that would go back and forth like between I like eye gloss on my eyes yeah but i don't i don't want to use unknown products on your beautiful eyes we'll try mommy's eyes can you see anything ella i only see glitter is it just glittery yeah okay it feels super wet i want to feel super wet does it look nice i can't even tell i don't know that it doesn't nice. feel bad look it doesn't feel sticky at all well this is oh this i i i feel all this so yeah, that was uh that snail stuff New stuff? Snail. We have two other things to try, however. We do have the mint chocolate moist pack, which honestly, because I already used a face mask in this video, I kind of want to save this one. I really do. Like, I want to use it on my own time. Um, lip masks, I mean, basically, like you can see the back. The girl is just wearing a lip mask and it works very similarly to a face mask. So I don't feel like there's a whole lot to show with that. The last thing and the most interesting thing I think was the whipped cream face wash. So at this point, I'm definitely gonna be washing my face. Um, we're just gonna have to open it and kind of figure out how this works. So it does come in, oh, this is heavy. This is much heavier than I thought it would be. Okay. It comes in this clear plastic container. And it comes with a lid, oh, a little, it, yeah, um, it's really heavy. Yeah, two, two little packages, and then just kind of like, like a drinking thing? cup. Kinda. I'm assuming for this, based off of the directions, um, it shows that the cover is off. And then I'm gonna take one of these packages. So it does seem to confirm that this is like a two time use thing. Um, I'm sure you could buy more of these packages. But I'm going to dump this into the container. So that's what it is, just like a super fine powder. And then I did grab a little bit of water. I just don't know how much. It literally shows like a couple drops. Oh wait. Okay, so this two little indicator lines. I don't know if you can see, but it says like creamy awa. <laughs> it says creamy and then underneath it has another line and it shows, I think it points, there's a little tiny arrow that points to the creamy line. So that's what I'm gonna, oh boy, I just hope I don't screw this up. I mean, I have another package if I do, but I'm gonna fill it up to that second line. You can't even take the cover mm -hmm. off. And then it shows to put, oops, sorry, you okay? Yeah. To put the cover back on and then it says up and down. Oh. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> oh, okay. Okay, that is crazy. It looks like applesauce. Because it's like this yellowy so, color. Oh my goodness. The diagram shows it coming all the way up to the top. Yeah. Can I try? Do you want to try? Yeah, I'll hold it for you. Up and down. Whoa! Up and down. It's kind of hard, huh? And then we you can actually get on. I think that should be good. I mean, this whole thing is. Wow. Can I touch it? Just a tiny bit. It's like soap. Don't eat it. <laughs> it's Don't. not even food. It, it is soap. It's a face wash. So I'm just going to keep doing it. Well, doing should... this. <laughs> Ooh, that's so crazy. This product is so much. No, 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 no more. This product is like just fun to make. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> I think I might want to leave. How do I? Oh, I'm making a mess. Okay, I'm gonna like scrape. Oh, that feels so weird. Oh my goodness. But here we go, because we're gonna wash my face and I don't want to ruin my lashes. So these are coming off. Ew! <laughs> Ew. What? I don't like the eyelashes coming off. That's <laughs> disgusting. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try to wash my face with this. This seems like a lot of like a lot of face Ooh. Oh. <laughs> i'll put some more my face too no not your face baby like mine is already washed mm -hmm. it, it's kind of like foamy at first but like as you work it into your skin it like starts to kind of disappear but it feels really nice it doesn't feel like cold it's warm oh, oh i'm getting it in my hair <laughs> 
I will admit that the parts that are still foamy on my face really do tickle like crazy, so I'm trying to really work it in. I, I don't know, like, can I save this? <laughs> I just feel like that's a lot of product to go to waste. I don't know, like, would it disintegrate after a while? Cause I, it looks like, like a water cup. Yeah, like my face is definitely like entirely covered. I'm gonna have to figure that out, um, I guess, on my own after this video, but I'm gonna go but wash this off real quick and then I'll be right back. All right, all I did was rinse this off with water. So now I'm going in with a makeup wipe. So, I mean, just for my cheek alone, <laughs> there's still quite a bit of makeup on here. Granted, I, you know, I usually go in with a makeup wipe first and then wash it off. So I'm probably not giving it the uh, fairest of shots here. I definitely have less makeup on than I had on this morning. So overall, I think this product was a lot of fun to use. I know I look crazy right now. I gotta finish taking off my makeup and I'm gonna hop in the shower. <laughs> I think this product was a lot of fun to use. I'm still curious if I'm able to kind of like take out this little stick and then cap it and save it for another use. I don't know if that's even like sanitary because my fingers were in it. Whoops. I think the subscription box was so much fun. Again, I really like the fact that I got full size product and not sample sizes. The packaging was awesome. I think all of the products were really great. There was only the one that I didn't use, which was the lip mask. But again, I've used them before and they're amazing. Even though the colors weren't exactly me. I mean, think it's a Japanese and a Korean beauty box. You know, I think these were great products. They just weren't the exact color match for me, but that has nothing to do with the product itself. I thought everything I used today was really, really great. So if you guys enjoyed today's video, please go ahead, leave a thumbs up. And while you're down there, hit that subscribe button. Also, if you're interested in getting your own box, again, there is a link down below. Feel free to use my code. Once again, you don't have to, it's there if you want to use it. But I just appreciate you guys watching today's video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.